Hi right, guys, sorry about the not posting many videos. I've got a lot on at the moment going on, so just bear with me. I will do more videos eventually, but I've just got a lot on at the moment. Um, so here, I had to share this one. So I'm going to read it. I'm not going to explain it. I'm just going to read it and you can come up with your own views on it. So here it goes. Cyber attack has menaced to effective governance in Nigeria. Wonder who these guys are. Okay. Abstract. Cyber attack is an attempt by hackers to damage or destroy a computer network or system for a purpose of mischief and fraud and hedonism. To say that it incident incidents is of cyber attack are increasing rapidly in nigeria is not only an understatement but also a cliche from the organized private sector to public service hackers have not spent any en entity more recently governments in both developed and developing countries have had to deal with this menace <clears throat> on a frequent basis the government of Nigeria is not an exception, the fawn in the flesh. Indeed, some government officials have blamed the ineffective governance on the menace cyber attack, thereby creating the impetus for this research. The study, therefore, inve investigates the incidences of cyber attacks in Nigeria and its impact on the democratic governance. The study was based on a descriptive and explorative research design. This involves the use of research instrument administered, administered to retrieve vital information from the target audience. The information gathered were coded into scale variables that support impartial investigation of the subject matter. In this study, a total of 150 questionnaires from which a total of 126 were retrieved and used for the anal an analysis. The data analysis utilised frequency distribution involving percentage and factor analysis. This method is frequently used in the social sciences of research. Both factor analysis and regional analysis were applied. Factor analysis established and the most prominent factor responsible for the cyber attack motivation motivation while the uh, relational analysis was further utilised in the examine, hold on, for my utilise in the examining the determined effect of incidents and nature of cyber attacks on the assessment of the effectiveness governance in Nigeria. So something planned for Nigeria, there, guys. Um, the evidence from the study provides significant result in support of the significant influence by cyber attack menace on the per perception of governance. Analysis of the motivating factors suggests that financial benefits, this is where it gets interesting, and wide dis dis dissemination of the virus accounted for most factor responsible for the attacks. The study therefore recommends that government and law enforcement agencies should strategize on means of providing a more comprehensive database to facilitate effective investigation and further research in this area. I'll leave the, this, that's not even in the introduction, there's loads here guys, I'll put the link in the description and you can read it for yourself. Cheers.